welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna try the Trader Joe's organic watermelon jerky dried watermelon. I have made something similar to this. I call it watermelon leather, whatever. I had a food dehydrator for a while and um, I put watermelon slices and dehydrated it and my roommate wasn't too crazy about it and it wasn't as good as fresh watermelon but it like was had that good punch because obviously it's dehydrated so had that real strong worm and obviously better than watermelon artificial candy but um i got it at trader joe's i think it was a was it a dollar 99 or was it four dollars or three dollars i don't even remember how much i paid Product to mexico okay it smells similar to the one I made, but then there's another <laughs> smell. It's not bad. It's all stuck to each other. See the one I made when the dehydrated wasn't. It still had moisture in it, which obviously they can't do that because they'll grow bacteria. Okay, it's all right. I don't like lime juice in my watermelon. I just like watermelon, and then I also like watermelon and mint, and then that's it. I like it cold. And I like it sweet. That's just me. I'm not saying that it tastes like it has lime in it. But there's an extra something, a taste. I'm thinking preservative. Ingredients, organic watermelon. Mm, maybe it is, but... It's really sticky. It's already sticking to my teeth. Um, if you're craving watermelon and it's out of season and you don't want watermelon artificial candy, this is better than nothing because I love watermelon. So maybe during the winter time when watermelons are out of season, it'd be like a good thing if you're craving watermelon. I personally cut up watermelon and freeze it and put my Vitamix with the tamper and make it like a slushy. It's not bad though, but it does have an extra little taste that I'm not digging. There's more in there, it looks like. It really sticks to your teeth though. It's not bad. It could be sweeter. Well, no, no, that's right. If it's sweet enough, it could have more flavor. You know, some watermelons don't have a lot of flavor. I live in Texas. We're supposed to have really good watermelons. And I was at Sprouts the other day, and I got a watermelon that was really, really good. Way better than the ones I've been getting at HEB. And so, you know, that's all right. I give it like a... If it didn't have that extra flavor coming through, I would give it like a solid It's a hard one because I love watermelon, but I'm so used to it being a fresh. I give it I'll just give it like a six point five out of ten. Um try it. It's not that expensive, you know, just try it. But other than that, please comment, like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you'll know when I get some new videos. Until next time. Oh, do you like my shirt? I got it in Houston, Texas at, uh, what was the name of it? It's like a Meow Wolf. If you've never heard of Meow Wolf, check it out. But it's like Meow Wolf type of interactive art thing. But it's in Houston. And it's called um, Seismic. I try to remember, I'll leave a link below the video. 
But yeah, Meow Wolf is just an awesome, awesome, awesome place to go. But um, but that's why I got the shirt. So until next time, uh, please let me know what uh, food you want me to try also, and I'll try my best to, to get on that. All right, until next time, have an awesome day. Goodbye.